So this is another tool which I use and uh, this is called a foam roller. So you can purchase this foam rollers which you can get in the market and uh, place the foam roller uh, over here. So foam roller is used as a roller tool kind of. And uh, so what you can do is for beginners who don't have any practice, they can uh, pull up this, be in this position, hands back and then they can just uh, uh, do up and down, push forward and back. So they can do in this position and this will stretch this muscle, the, the, the back leg muscle, the back upper leg muscle. And for experienced guys, uh, for after uh, some experience which you do, what you can do is like bring one leg over here. So you want to get more stretch on one of the leg. One leg should be here. The other leg, bring it on top of the first leg, so as to create additional pressure and weight. And then you can do a similar thing. Similarly do it for the other leg. So once you are done with this, now what we will be doing is we will be stretching this part. So for that, we will be having the foot roller in this position, the hand should be in this position, the other hand should be in this position to support uh, your complete body. Once you do this, move up, your legs should be straight and then you will be going again up and down. So this will be again stretching your muscles at different muscles. Do it 10 times. So going to the other side. Now what I'll be doing is I'll be stretching this muscle uh, in, in, in a cross way. So I'll be stretching in this way. So what I'll be doing is I will be doing bringing this foam roller here, and the idea is to stretch in this way, in this pattern. So there is a muscle out there uh, in the hip which at which I will be stretching and which is in this position. So do it in this way. Do it 10 times. For beginners, you can do it this way. For experience, you can create more pressure by bringing other leg towards this position and then doing up and down. Okay. So now moving to the other side. Similarly. this the last exercise which I do is to stretch my upper back and this is really good uh, I don't have any problem in upper back but still uh, this whenever I do this I get a very nice stretch and I, every time I feel that uh, my upper back is stretching and I really feel very good so bring the foam roller here the leg should be in this position and then Bring your back down and be in this position. Move your heads, uh, move your hands uh, below the head. Pull up this, pull up the legs and the complete body, and then go up and down. Remember, when doing this exercise, you should not be bringing. Uh, from foam roller down your lower back. It should primarily be hitting your rib cage and it should not go down because uh, the lower part of the spine it's not protected by the rib cage 
and how there are discs and muscles and if we give direct exposure to those uh, and we get a uh, good amount of weight so those can be damaged. So we'll just do it in the upper back. When you're done with it, 10 times. That's it guys. Uh, so these are the set of exercises which I do and uh, hope you like this video and see you see again. See you soon again in some other video. Thank you guys. Bye. This is Sunny.